and welcome guys, this is Dean from Lazy Game Bros and I'm bringing a awesome new uh, early access game that has been greenlit uh, on Steam and it's called Tricone Lab and let's just jump into this, I played a bit of it just to make sure like, we know what's what but uh, let's go, uh, can I, let's see if I can get rid of all my reset all, there we go, you ready? So. Let's go. So I've got a bit of information on the game uh, that I'm going to start reading out. Uh, but let's go straight into this. It's, it'll take take us for it. So remember, this is an early access. Uh, so there's little things that can be improved in that. But this is the puzzles are awesome. So what we have to do is we have these three colours: the green, the red, and the blue. And all we have to do is drag them to this guy. Right, this is a catalyst. This is called the tricone. We can press D to describe it, but we don't have any information yet. So, all we're going to do is synthesize it. So, press F1 if we want a shortcut. There we go. And in the top corner, which we can't do because I've just missed it, right. So, this does a cool thing. So, we can go either, we can go here to the first one, uh, double synthesize, or we can go twisty synthesize. But the thing is, if we can complete one, we're not. We have to do the other one to make it around. So we have a load of keys here. Keys, not yet done. Load maps. These are all the maps that you can do. But we're going to look into that later. So let's go into our second level. And here we go. Right. So we've got info at the top. It tells you what the objective is. Also tells you down here in the bottom right, which is called. So it's synthesized two units uh, of trichome. Difficulty, 1 out of 5. So, stats. This is uh, going online, and this is measuring it against whoever else has played it. So, 27 people have played it, 27 have done it. Average attempts, 1 to complete. Uh, medium of total time spent. Average total number of moves. Average total one blues. Right. So, you can't put two blues on it. It will automatically select or highlight one of the other colours that you need to do. So, F1, done. Right. And then, you... To my knowledge, I don't have a button that can automatically select the green. I think you just have to click on them and you drag them. So, that's that level done. And let's go into twisty synthesize. Alright, so this one's quite an easy one. But what we do here is they can't go over these lines here, the cells. So it has to go around. And then as this one goes around, that one can't go through that line. So it's all about making sure it's like tracing us. Uh, line for a circle or a maze yeah so we're done and then synthesize you can synthesize it before it actually reaches the end so uh, let's go on to this first break breaker right so let's go all right so this is called a breaker so you double click on this and it will explode and that's as simple as it is I'll go more into it as we get later on but there we go level done and this is Tricone, the first chapter, this comes to the tutorial. Right, so now, this one's an easy one. So we'll click these, and these will let these out. But then in the meantime, we can get these guys to connect here, and there we go. Done. Hmm. So, uh, this is a game by Josh Singer. Uh, basically, the game design, the programming, and the graphics are all done by uh, Josh Singer. Oh, don't know if my game froze. No, it hadn't. Okay then. So uh, that was the first uh, tutorial. Let's go on to the next, yeah? So it's uh, by Josh Singer, a programmer based in Glasgow, Scotland. Uh, the sound effects were contributed by Jack uh, Menhorn, and the music was by Leon uh, Foxwell, aka Hollow Beams. So, the music is quite good. It it fits the feel of the game. Right, so these guys, so these are breakers, we can press D, no information yet. So uh, these guys basically they have a black circle that's running around them. Uh, this means that they can travel through, they can touch one of these uh, inner cell walls basically and then as soon as they go through it, so if I go here and then go through, 
it can't go back out because it doesn't have one of the little uh, dots going around it. So what we're going to do is going to put on this wall, we're going to break it and then we're going to connect that, break that, F1. So you might not see me click on these guys but I'm pressing F1 to complete the action. Right, so there we go. Right, so we've got uh, triple move. So these are slowly getting a little bit more difficult. Right, so here we go. It has three cells, so it can move through one, it can move through two, and it can hit the third, and then we'll break it, and then we'll connect it. Yep, so there we go, synthesized. So uh, undo and reset. If you think you may uh, have made a mistake, you can undo them to reverse the last action. You can also restart to the beginning of the level again. Uh, beginning the level again from the beginning. Okay, so we've got matching moves now. All right, let's go into it. All right, so now it just gets a bit more logical. You have to think what's going to happen. All right, so this red needs to go here. But the thing is, I know that I only need to break this line here. I don't need to waste a line getting broke on this one. So I can press F1 and then it'll break. Connect it, done. First one done. All right, so what I'm going to do is connect this one here. Connect the green to our middle one. F1, done. Right, I'm going to show you what happens here. So just because this has two dots left around it, if I break this, it will disappear completely, which I don't want. So I'm pressing Z to undo that move. And then I'll take it in here, and then I'll bring it round, and then that's the last one, and then we do it there, and we connect it, and F1. So that's three of three uh, tricones. That's done. That was easy. Right, so we've got break slice. Right, so kind of getting into it. So let's have a look at the stats. So we've got need to make two. Right, communicating, 22 players have played it, 18 players have completed it, average time is 1 minute 53. Right, so let's go through this. So we've got a 2 here, and we've got a, right, so let me think, uh, how are we going to do this? 1, 2, 3, right, so here we go. Right, just thinking around it, so connect this one here, go around, connect to here. Going to connect that and go straight there and then this one has two originally we could have gone through this one and then that one and that one but that was a three which we didn't have uh, so then let's connect this and we're done right so that's it done uh, oh sorry and then we're done one thing it would be cool which uh, I might talk to talk to Josh about is getting a timer so even though it's calculating it all in the end ah oh, this one uh, it's calculating it all in the end it doesn't show you it doesn't show you at the end comparing your results and so maybe that'll be a good thing uh, that would be a bit of competition all right so we've got these two that need to connect here and then we've got this red that needs to connect here so let me think how are we going to do this all right so this one's i might do it first time this one i think is cheat you no it doesn't I think I might this up right let's get that there and get that here and break it and then let's go in here and go there All right let's synthesize that now this one won't work because we have one two three four so I've done this one already so let's restart by pressing R and let's go into it again All right so just gonna have a look at this all right so if we get one two break that this will have three there and then let's carry on so let's go hmm you know what i found out all right so this one is we're going to connect this one here two and we only have one go left so let's put it here and let's break it from here it should be easy because we only have two goes on each one and I've used one on each and then we'll go here connect it to the other one we'll break it break it again and connect it so Josh has been programming uh, I've chatted him for a bit and he's uh, been programming since the uh, age of eight uh, he started I think on ZX Spectrum Basics uh, 
and he's basically been uh, developing this game in his spare time and there we are that's breakers so we've got an achievement that's cool uh, so key gained tricon uh, you have gained uh, the tricon key gaining keys allow uh, keys unlock new maps to play right so as we're going through this quite quick might give it another one right so uh, well, what's this one uh, breaker maker uh, It'd be cool if I had a st stat for like how quick it took to complete this whole unit and if you could speed run it kind of. Right, so now we've got new one, uh, Breaker Synth... Uh, so what have we got? So we've got Breaker Template. So basically one of these connect to these guys and this creates one of the breakers that we had before. So F1 again, yeah? And then that connects, makes one, and then break it and then connect it again. And we're done. Uh, so we've developing uh, to been developing this game in his spare time for quite a while uh, his main job is uh, bionic informatics uh, research programmer uh, in Glasgow University Center for virus research so you can see where his passions come from like he knows kind of a lot about cells even though this isn't really cells or that but it's a uh, oh Right, so let's collect this one, to, oh, this one to there, that one to there. Right, so it can travel through this gap in the middle. So let's go one, two, three, and let's get this one and connect it here, and we're done. Uh, so you can see this is, it's something that's close to him. It works with his job and that. Uh, maybe made a bit, I don't know, simple in, as in, the images are easy to distinguish from each other uh, so let's see we got a blue we got that so if I get a two here all right so what I'm gonna do is gonna break this wall with this one so I'm gonna take this through here bring it around so we need two tri cones all right so that's connected oh and there and then I'm just gonna break the whole of the bubble around all around the green and red one and then we're just going to let the blue end when it lets us in there we go boom done uh, winner but no matter how much you go on about this might be uh, inspired by his job he uh, he claims the, that the, the biological theme of tricone lab is mostly accidental it might have been just going for a puzzle game and it just so happened that it's come it's molded more into the style of his work so I'm just gonna have a drink all right so here we go uh, right so we got tricone here so we've got a one so if we break this one let's do it why, why talk about it let's just go for it all right so we've got this one here and I think I'm gonna go one there, get these guys to break, get this one here, break this one, do this one, get it down to the bottom, break that, use the top one to go up there, get the red, green, and get the blue, and connect it, done. So, let's go for a bit longer, sorry if I'm whizzing through these guys. <laughs> uh, I played the first, I think, four sections, uh, but they did take me a while, like it starts getting a bit more difficult and it starts making you think outside the box. Uh, so the next mobility. So this is kind of the end of level where they kind of sometimes, no, they haven't introduced it yet. Okay, sorry. Alright, so we've got a ready-made one here. All right. So let's see this. Alright, so we're connecting this to there. We're going to make another breaker, a single, a single block breaker. But we're not going to break this one. We're going to add this one in here, and then we're going to extend this through both walls to oh, to break this and connect there, which is easy done. So most of these levels didn't take me this quick. Uh, I haven't played this. I played it a week ago. Oh, might have frozen. Sorry guys. There we 
we go. Alright, so I'm going to leave it here. I'm sorry if I went quiet at the end, but this is Dean from Lazy Game Bros, and uh, this is Tricone Lab. Uh, this is, uh, I think, the first two, three, three sections. Uh, I'll list them in the sub, and we're going to start going blind in the next section or whatever. Uh, but until then, uh, if you like the game, go and support it. You can uh, get on Steam, and I think a lot of the other websites out there. I'll get a list of them, and I'll put a list in my description. Until then guys, see you later.